Good morning, you guys. It's Sunday. I'm on my way to work. What a surprise. <laughs> I seem to always vlog when I'm on my way to work. Or after I've left work. And it always seems to be Sunday. <sighs> Let's see. Uh, so we had our first week of school. Ashley's school. Um, she started last Wednesday. And so far, it's been really good. She is enjoying her classes and the weird schedule that they have. I think I've mentioned this already. They have what's called an odd even schedule. So she has eight classes. She sees all eight classes, all eight teachers on Monday. And then Tuesday and Thursday is the odd schedule. So she'd go to class one, three, five, and seven. And then on Wednesday and Friday is the even schedule. So she would see go to classes two, four, six, and eight. Um, so it's just a little bit different. It makes it a little bit more challenging. You know, she's got to remember every day which day of the week it is, which class schedule, which route. Um, oh, I just remembered I forgot to put blush on this morning. Hold on, let me put blush on. There, that's better. So Ashley's had her um, odd even schedule. It's all worked out really, really well so far for her. She seems to be doing just fine. Um, Preston has not started school, homeschool yet. He will start on Tuesday this week. Monday, tomorrow is Labor Day, and so everyone has off. And I think we're all just very excited about this one last holiday before we have the um, rigid schedule of like Monday through Friday, Monday through Friday, Monday through Friday, and the schedule that comes along with it. So I'm excited for Labor Day. I'm excited to just have a day off. Uh, Wednesday, he starts baseball. So now this is a big deal because Preston is turning nine um, in a week, a uh, week and a half. He is definitely not our sports kid. He um, He's definitely in the era of video games and um, computer games and movies and kind of more um, isolated solo kind of things. He enjoys having friends, but he really has one good friend left from when he was in public school. And um, while I don't like the emphasis of socializing your children, and that's why they should be in public school, I do think that he should be in things, in extracurricular activities where he has the ability to make other friends and to do outside um, activities, get some exercise. Um, and makes just make some other connections. So this, I like that he is homeschooled. He can focus on his schooling, schooling. And we get done, you know, his school's done in three to four hours every day because it's just him and me and it's quick, you know. But at the same time, I also like the idea of him being able to make some other friends. So we decided this year that for the entire school year, he was going to be in enrolled in something else one or two things at all times um ashley's doing violin at school and she's doing volleyball at school so she's doing two things already and she also is in dance at school um so she's got three things so preston is signed up for art class which um i posted a video about already and that seems to be going well and then i also just gave him a, a list of choices you know like what Here's, you know, five things. I want you to pick one. So we had um, soccer, swimming, baseball, um, gymnastics, and I think karate was the other one. So I gave him like five things and I just said pick one. And for the longest time I thought he was gonna choose soccer and finally he, decided on baseball. I We went to the baseball field yesterday where he's going to have practices and Ashley and I did the volleyball back and forth to each other for a while and I realized that I'm still pretty good at volleyball. Um, and Nick and Preston threw the ball back and forth to each other and Nick would throw it and Preston would hit and stuff like that and then we had just a little family game. Um, Preston has a really good arm. I was I was shocked, honestly. Like, he can throw 
far and he can throw hard and he can throw exactly where it needs to go. That's really, really impressive. I had no idea. So I don't know if that'll mean that he'll just be a pitcher the whole time and I'll never actually play or if that's just, um, you know, maybe he'll be good on first base or third base. I don't know. But um, he really enjoys batting and he really enjoys running. I just think baseball, honestly, all the way around is going to be really good for him. And I think he's really going to enjoy it. Um, so his practices start on Wednesday. And they're going to be every Monday and Wednesday in the evening. And, um, and then we'll have games in a couple of weeks. Probably on Sundays, I think, is when the games are going to be. Um, so I'm excited. I'll get some footage and you guys can see all that. But I have work for like three and a half hours and then we're going, I'm meeting Nick and the kids at church. And then we have the rest of the day together. I am so excited to just be together all day today. Today, I'm just, I need, I need some time with my family. You know, they forget that way. And I have a few really, really, um, I have a few kind of intense things coming up that I don't really want to talk about in here. And they're giving me a lot of anxiety. I, I don't get stressed. I seriously, I'm not the kind of person that gets stressed ever. Um, I kind of just, I kind of just deal with stuff. And I'm usually really, really good at just dealing with my emotions and what's going on around me. But this thing that I'm contemplating, I, I, it's giving, it's like making me riddled with anxiety. So I'm not stressed, but I'm super anxious. And I, I hate that. That's just as bad. So, and I'm like in the process of crying all the time. So anyway, I'm rambling. I'm going to go. Okay. Talk to you later. Bye.